everybody. Hello, everybody. Just give me a moment. Let me try. Hello. All right, there we go. Hi, guys. Good. Hi. Hello, hello. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, how are you? Pretty good? Pretty good. All right, good, excellent. How are your vacations? Not so good. We no? have to work. Oh, yeah, yeah. No diga la crítica que aquí está el budín. Yo también quiero. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, I know, I understand that it's it's not easy to be, um, to be working when everybody is on vacation and everything. But, um, eh, Pero sí, la semana pasada sí me imagino que tuvieron su, su día de descanso, ¿verdad? Sí. Sí, sí. ¿Sí? Ok. So, ahí sí, ¿verdad? Aprovecharon ya no tuvieron que, no tuvieron clase, pudieron estar tranquilos, right Yes? Yes, yes. Ok, so there you go. So at, at least you, you are able, you were able to do that, right? That's, that's the, 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 the nice part. Okay. What what did you do? Did you do did you go anywhere interesting? Somewhere somewhere nice? No? No. I no? stayed at home. You stayed at home? You didn't go to the beach or or, or to the no. rides? No, no. No? No, they didn't go to, to um como se llama ese lugar? Sibar Sibarland? No. No. <laughs> no? No, you didn't do any of that? No. Oh, okay. N nobody went to see uh to, to that place. No? Nadie fue. Nadie fue de a a, a montarse las ruedas. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Um Okay, so what we're going to do right now, actually, um, I need you guys to help me with something. Um, do you remember that, um, do you remember that uh, we, we I, I told you at the beginning of this course that we didn't have a list, and it was true, we didn't have a list. But they just gave, they gave me, um, in these days, they gave me the list to take. So I'm going to need you guys to help me out to figure it out, um, the list, okay? Okay. Sí. Entonces, uh, porque como ya pasaron varios, varios días, digamos, necesito saber exactamente... Como, como sería. Ok, necesito que me, que me ayuden con eso. Ok. Ok. Bye. Um, ok. Vamos a ver. Three, four, five, six. Hmm. Okay, just give me a moment, guys. I'm trying to figure this one out. Okay. Okay, so 
Vale, vamos a hacerlo de esta forma. Creo que es, va a ser más fácil si lo hacemos así. Ok. Um, is um, Alicia Beatriz Garcia here? No. No está. ¿Has estado conectando? Porque sé no. que hay una gente que no se ha estado conectando. No. Ok. Sigamos entonces. Um, Fátima Roxana Rivera. Tampoco. No. Okay. Eh, no, no se estaba conectando. Y estoy por si me llamó. Mm, mm, mm. No, no, no. No, es que le, está, vale, le estoy eh, explicando ahí que um, durante las vacaciones me mandaron la lista. Eh, ya, ya se conformó la lista. Pero ahora tenemos que poner, ponernos de acuerdo ahí para, para completar lo que había, lo que quedaba pendiente. Entonces, um, ya, yeah. vamos a ver, ok. Eh, seamos José Ramón Polanco. I hear it, teacher. Ok, va. me va a ayudar entonces. Ok. Me va a ayudar a, ahí a descifrar cómo estamos ahí con la lista. Ok. Ok. Va. El primer día estuve en clase. Sí. Yes, of course. Okay. okay. So this is our fifth, no, no, sixth, sixth day. Right? This is our sixth day. So I'm going to be asking about the, the five previous. Okay. Second day, were you in class? Yes. Uh, yes. Solo una clase que no pude estar nomás, pero sí, en todo. Okay, all right. So, third day, the third class, were you, were you able to be in the third class? Yes. Okay. Yes. Good. Okay. Fourth class, were you in the last, in the fourth class? Yes. Yes? Oh, okay. Yes. Good. So, the last class, the what was the one you were not here? The last class, yes, mm -hmm. we, we talk about some golden gate and spiral. Okay, the last but, class. Okay, so my question is this: Okay, you said that you were not here for one class. Yes, well, for the second one class when we begin. Okay, so in the second class, you were not here. Ah, uh, yes, okay. Okay. That's what I wanted to know. Okay. Good. Thank you. So the second class, you were not here. Yes. And then, okay. And then the courses class are here. Okay. Let me just make sure I have it correct. Okay. So first class, you were here. Second, no. Third, yes. Fourth, Fifth, yes. fifth, you were here, and then, then this class. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Okay. okay. Siempre tengo que regresar a, a, a confirmar todo, pero igual. Eh, gracias ahí por. Okay. Actually, uy, perdón. Creo que se lo puse al equivocado, sí. Se lo puse equivocado. Okay, vamos a. Okay. All right. Okay, let's continue. Um Okay, quiero ver. Kevin Arnoldo. Present. Okay. So Kevin Arnoldo, were you here um on the first day of class? Eh, están todas las clases. 
You have been here in every every class? Sí. Okay. You haven't missed any of us. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Um, Maxi Maximiliano Edgardo? Yes, I'm here. Okay, okay. wonderful. Uh, did you miss any classes? No. I think that's easier to put it that way. So you were here in all the, the classes? The yes. previous five classes? Yes. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, Roberto Antonio Martinez. No está, ¿verdad? Okay, ha estado con nosotros Roberto Antonio. ¿Ha estado conectando? No se acuerdan. I don't remember. No? Can't remember? Okay, no problem. Okay. Okay, vamos. Sigamos entonces. Um, Edwin Antonio Torres. Edwin Antonio Torres. Yes. Okay, perfect. There you are. Okay. Uh, have you missed any classes, Edwin? Yes, the third class. The third class. Yes. Thank you. Okay, so yeah. Okay, thank you very much. All right, let's continue. Um, Erika Jamilet Orellana. Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon, Erika. Uh, is it possible to turn on your camera? Perdón, teacher. Is it possible to turn on your camera? Es posible. Voy a ver si ahorita. Ahora ticha. Ah, there you are. Okay, hoy sí, hoy se la miro. Okay. Um Erika, have you been absent in any class? Eh how do you say? Una he faltado, teacher, una okay. clase. ¿Cuál? Mm, este, quiero ver. Creo que fue la... La tercera clase. Como la cuarta, creo yo, teacher. La tercera o la cuarta? Este quiero ver. Fue la última la recibimos de las cosas de, de las ubicaciones, de los lugares. Una anterior a esa creería yo que no fue la que recibí. Entonces la, la penúltima. Uh -huh. Sería esa. La penúltima clase no estuvo, el, el día número cuatro. Ok. Gracias. Ok. A ver aquí en el calendario. Voy a asegurarme bien con la fecha ahorita en el calendario, dicho. Okay. Perfecto. Es que me Mucho que mejor se puede hacer eso. Igual puedo, puedo regresar, voy a regresar a ver los videos, pero, pero creo que es más fácil y más rápido hacerlo así, pero. Ok. Eh, Ernesto Antonio Espinosa. Ernesto 
El resto de Antonio no está, ok. Eh, José Alberto Orante. Uh -huh. José Alberto Orantes. No, ok. Uh, Juan Carlos Morán. Juan Carlos Morán. Morán. Ok. Entonces, seguimos Juan Carlos Padilla. Present. All right. Wonderful. Juan Carlos, have you missed any classes? Yo me. Have you missed any classes? Yes. Which uh, one? The first class. The first class. The third. Yes, okay. I remember. But... Okay. Okay. Thank you. Solo esa? Yes. Okay. okay. Thank you very much. Teacher. Yeah. Eh, entonces fue el día 27 de julio que no estuve en la clase. 27 de julio. Déjeme ver. Uh -huh. El 27 de julio. Que ese día este, no, no tuve internet. Mm, ok, entonces fue la, entonces si no me equivoco, pues sí, eso, ajá, sí, sí, porque la, la última clase, ah, fue la de el las 28, las ajá, y fue la, el día 28, uh -huh. ajá, entonces sí, la penúltima, sí, so, ok, sí, está bien, perfecto, thank you. Bueno, okay. Um, Catherine Ivonne Palacios. No. Roberto ba Barbin Lem uh, Lemus. Present. Okay, wonderful. Eh, ¿Ha perdido una, alguna clase? No. 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 You have been present every class. Yes. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's continue. Oh. It's a moment. Un momento, chicos, que me equivoqué de línea. Estoy teniendo que hacer esto otra vez. Gracias, chicos, por su paciencia. Y lastimosamente. No teníamos... Okay. All right, let's continue. Hmm. Okay. Um so uh Ad Adriana Marcela Marcela Velasquez. Adriana Marcela Velázquez. Uh, Brian Enrique, eh, sorry, Brian Henry Rivas. Brian Henry. Carlos Enrique Mendoza. Carlos Present Enrique. Present Okay, perfecto. Um, have we missed any classes? Carlos? Carlos, have you missed any classes? ¿Ha, ha perdido alguna clase? Eh, Carlos, perdón que sé que está manejando, pero uh, solo se me, po me podría responder si. Si ha perdido alguna clase. 
Sí, este, la primera, por lo mismo, me tocó que venir a trabajar y ahorita okay. voy a salir. Ok, no problem. ¿Ahorita vas saliendo de trabajar? Sí, ahorita. Ah, ok. Bueno, lo bueno es de que ya, ya salió. Sí. Ya está libre. Ok, very good. Ok, thank you for connecting. Ok, y quiero ver, seguimos, seguimos con Dani, Dani Elías. Daniel Elías Manzano, ¿no? Eh, Daniel Alfredo Hernández. Daniel, Daniel Alfredo Hernández. Hamilton Arnoldo Sigüenza. ¿No? Ok, Héctor Manuel Ram, Ramos. Héctor Ram, uh, Manuel Ramos, Jacqueline Vanessa Fuentes, Jacqueline Vanessa Fuentes, José uh, Alexander Ara, Araujo. Present teacher. Ok, perfecto. Eh, have you missed any classes, José? Eh, the last class that I was not. Solo la última clase no estuvo. Okay. So uh, all the other classes you have had? Just yeah. last class. Okay. Yes. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Thank you. Um, Josué oh, David bueno. Ca Cardona. Josué David Cardona. Kelvin Iván Martínez. Kelvin Iván Martínez. Marlon Alberto Peñate. Marlon Alberto Peña Peñate. Marlon Omar Menjibar. Marlon Omar Menjibar. Marvin Arnoldo Caballero. Presente, teacher. Okay, perfecto. Eh, how many classes have you missed? Uh, I just missed the last class. Just, just the last class? Yes. Okay, all the other classes you have been here. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. And Oscar Alexander Vasquez. Presente, teacher. Okay, how many classes have you missed? Uh, in the far class, the fourth I class, was not present. Okay, fourth class, pardon. the first or the fourth? The first, the first. Okay, the first class. Okay, thank you very much. Ya casi terminamos, chicos. Oscar Armando Flores. Oscar Armando Flores. Oscar Mauricio Orellana. Oscar Mauricio Orellana. Uh, Rocío Jasmine Tejada. Rocío Jasmín Tejada y Walter Antonio Mejía. Walter Antonio Mejía. Ok. Bueno, chicos, muchas gracias ahí por eh, la paciencia. Eh, sé que, que no es fácil ahí ser, tener que estar ahí 
esperando, pero um, sí, um, teníamos ahí, como les comentaba, no habíamos tenido la oportunidad de, de um, conformar ahí el, um, el, la, la asistencia, pero eh, ya, ya lo tenemos, entonces um, necesitábamos ahí ponerla al día. Ok, so guys, um, what we're going to do, start the cast, just give me one moment. Ah, por cierto, ¿cómo vamos con la plataforma? I already finished all. You finished? Finished. Wonderful, finished. very good. Finished. Excellent, excellent. Ya, yeah. eh, como les mencionaba anteriormente, um, solo tenemos tres clases eh, que nos faltan. Eso nos hacen falta. Esa, esa clase mañana. Y te, todavía estamos pendientes para, uh, para la última clase. No me han confirmado qué día va a ser. Porque se supone que estaba programada para el 14, pero ustedes me dijeron que tienen, tienen que trabajar el 14, ¿verdad? Sí, ¿verdad? Si, yes, no me, si no me equivoco. Right. Sí. Ok. Ya. Yeah. So, estamos, con, estamos todavía ahí eh, en espera para... La confirmación del último día de clase. Okay, so anyways, so what we're going to do right now, we're going to start our class. Please tell me if you are able to see my, my screen. Yes. Okay. All right, so here we're, we're talking about the top eight things people hate to do. All right, so... We have stand in line, stand in line. Um, also, this this um, this is also possible to say um, stand in a queue. Have you ever heard of this? Stand in a queue. No. Never heard of that. No? Okay. Well, this is more like a British uh, expression. A queue is a line. Okay. Um, so you can, it, so it's more common in, in, in the United States, it's more common to hear a line, but it is possible um, to hear a queue like in other parts of the world. So it's very important that you know the meaning. Okay. So we have. Then we have do laundry, travel to work, go to meeting, exercise, work in the yard, clean the house, and open the mail. Mm -hmm. Okay, so my question is, well, actually, repeat after, I, I, before we, um, I get, I, I ask a question. I want you to repeat after me. Stand in line. Stand in line. Stand in line. Do laundry. Do laundry. Do laundry. Do laundry. Do laundry. Do laundry. Mm -hmm. Good. Um, travel to work. Travel to work. Travel to work. Travel to work. Go to meetings go, go to, to meetings. meetings go to meetings go to go meetings, to meetings. Mm -hmm. exercise 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 work in the yard work, work in the yard. yard clean the house clean, clean the house clean the house, mm -hmm. clean the house. open the mail Open, Open the mail. The mail. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. So my question is, which of these things do you hate to do? First of all, stand in line. Stand in line? Or stand in a queue? Mm -hmm. I hate stand Which one, Erika? Mm. 
I don't like stand in in line. You don't like to stand in line. Yeah, I understand. I don't like standing in line either. Yeah, I mean, I don't mind. I don't mind being in a line, but standing in line. Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty tiring. Okay, good. What else? What other things do you hate? Any any other from this list that you hate to do? Go to meetings. Go to meetings. Okay. Yes. Do you like? What about clean the house? No, I like cleaning the house. You like to clean the house? Wow. Okay. Great. Yes. Excellent. Anybody hate to exercise? No, I like. You like to do exercise? Yes, teacher. Yeah? Okay. All right. Good. Good. Excellent. All right. Very, very good. What are the things do you hate to do? Things that are not here. Wash the dishes. Hmm? What other things do you hate to do? Mm. Other things? Not not from this list, other things. Peter, mm, maybe I think these. A uh, read, uh, read newspaper is. Oh, I don't like. You don't like <laughs> to read newspapers. Oh, how interesting. Okay, all right. Um, all right. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to now look at this conversation. It says, um, so it says, I want I want you to listen and uh, repeat. Oh, sorry. Let's close this. Okay. All right. I'm going to listen. I'm going to read the conversation. You follow along and say it. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Did you, did you have a good weekend? Did you, you have, have a good weekend? Well, I had a busy weekend. Well, I had a busy weekend. And I feel a little tired today. And, and I feel, I feel, a, little feel a little tired, tired today. today. Really? Why? Really? Why? Why? Well, on Saturday... Well, on Saturday, on Saturday, I exercised in the morning. I exercised in the morning. Then my roommate. Then my roommate. Then my roommate. And I cleaned. And I cleaned. I cleaned. Did laundry. Did laundry. And shopped. And shopped. And then I visited my parents. And, and then, then I, I visited my parents. My parents. My parents. My my parents. parents. So oh what did you do on Sunday? So, so what, did you, what did you do on Sunday? Sunday. I studied for the test all day. I studied for the test all day. Oh no. Oh no. Do we have a test today? Do we have, Do we have a test today? I didn't study. I didn't study. I just watched television all weekend. I just watched the television all weekend. Good, bravo, excellent. Okay, questions about the vocabulary? Um, did 
teacher, I remember that in the platform, mm -hmm. uh, the the verbs, the past, the, the past verb, mm -hmm. they have a different pronunciation depending of of the vibration they cause on a throat. If I'm not mistaken, sounds sounds like a T, sounds like a D, and sounds like a TD. That's right. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Yes, so there is a, a difference in um, in the pronunciation at the end uh, for the EDs. So yes, you're absolutely right. So there's one that sounds like a D, right, sound. The other one like a T, and the other one like a ID. Um, and it all um, depends on the last the the last um sound of the syllable so um if if it finishes in a certain letters you will have to add um it was so basically if it's not not letters um sound if it finishes in, in a certain sound you would have to add an extra syllable so if it sounds if it finishes in the sound t or d like for example complete right complete it finishes in a t sound. In that case, you have to add an extra syllable. So you say completed or add, add d, 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 d. at the end, we have a d. So we have to add ed. So we have added, added. So yes, um, you have an extra syllable there. And then there are the ones that are what we call voiced and voiceless which has to do with the vibration at the end of the of the of the word so for example study 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 right if you put your 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 right here does it have a vibration study study yes okay so in that case uh we're going to, because it's 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 um there's a vibration study we it's voiced in that case you're going to pronounce it like a d sound so we say studied studied sounds like a d and then there are other ones that are like um for example walk walk do you do you feel a, a vibration walk no 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 vibration so that's voiceless in that case, you are going to uh, pronounce it like a t sound. So it's going to say walked, walked. Okay. So yeah, that's like that's like the short version. But yeah, um, yeah, that's a short version of the of the explanation. But um, yeah, I'm sure you have studied it in some moment. I'm not. I'm. I'm not. Well, let me see. No, 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 probably not. No, I think you're going to study a little bit later on. So don't worry, we'll, we'll get there, okay? But yeah, that's the okay. short explanation. If you understood it, great. If not, don't worry about it. We will study it later, okay? Okay, thanks. You're welcome. Okay, any other questions about pronunciation or or vocabulary? All right, so what I'm gonna do then is I'm going to get you guys to practice this conversation with a partner. One time you can be Michael, the other time you can be Jennifer, okay? So I'm going to stop sharing and I will share the conversation with you in the WhatsApp group. Just give me a moment. Okay. Do you see the conversation in the in the group? Yes. Yes. Okay. Perfect. So what I'm going to ask you guys to do, I'm going to ask you to um, work together with a partner. Like I said, one of one time you will be Michael, the other time 
you will be Jennifer, okay? And you're gonna have a chance to practice. With this exercise, my, my, my goal is for you to practice the pronunciations, okay? And yeah, mostly pronunciation because you can't really practice fluency because it's not your own words, but definitely pronunciation, okay? So I'm going to open up the groups. Just making sure, um, Juan Carlos Padilla, are you able to, to work, to participate? Okay, wonderful. What about Brian? Can you participate? Brian? Yes, coach. Okay. So you're able to participate? Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, so I'm opening oh. the groups right now. Okay, here we go. Hello, Carlos. Okay, I'm going to add you to a group. Even if you don't participate, it's okay. And I feel a little tired. Stay. Really? Why? Well, on Saturday, I exercise in the morning. Then my roommate and I cleaned it, did laundry, and shopped. And then I, I visited my parents. So what did you do on Saturday? I studied for the test all day. Oh, no. We have a test today. I didn't study. I just watched television all weekend. Hi, Jennifer. Did you have a good weekend? Well, I had a busy weekend and I feel a little tired today. Really? Why? Well, on Saturday, I exercise in the morning. Then my roommate and I clean it the laundry and shop it. and then I visited my parents. So what did you do on Sunday? I studied for the test all day. Oh no. Do we have a test today? I didn't study. I just watched television all weekend. No around? Okay. Hi, Jennifer, did you have a good weekend? Well, I had a busy weekend and I feel a little tired today. Eh, intercambiamos. Yeah, go ahead. You can um you can um continue practicing. Well, hi Jennifer. Did did you have a good weekend? Well, I had a bite. I have I have a vice weekend and I feel a little tired today. Really? Really why? Well, on Saturday I exercise in the morning. Then my room roommate and I clean, did laundry and shopping, and then I visit my party. 
So, what did you do on Saturday? On Sunday? I study. I study for the test all day. Oh no! Do you we have a test today? I did study. I just watched television. I weekend. Okay. Um. I. Okay. Uh huh. Where is the pronouns? Roommate. 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 What is the meaning, teacher? Roommate. Roommate is somebody that you live with. Like mm -hmm. if you if you share an apartment or a house with somebody, that's your roommate. Roommate. Okay. Uh, Oscar the other one. Okay. Pardon? De nuevo. Voy a empezar de nuevo. Bueno. Hi, Jennifer. Did you have a good weekend? Well, I had a busy weekend and feel a little tired today. Really? Why? Well, on Saturday, I exercise and in the morning, then my rooming and I clean it, die laundry and chopping, chop it and then visit my parents. So what do you do on Sunday? I Okay. All right, guys and girls. So, um, any questions about uh, the the pronunciation? A veces no es lo mismo ver la, la conversación que que de hecho hacerla. ¿verdad? Así que, do you have any questions about the pronunciation? No? Are you sure? Okay, perfect. Um, in that case, just give me a moment. Give me one second, guys. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to be um, learning a little bit about um, about the the past, how to create the past. Because if you notice in the conversation that we had, um, we were asking about um, they asked a lot a lot about what you did last weekend. Okay, so when we're talking about what we did last weekend, we're going to be talking about the past. And specifically, it's what we call the simple past. Okay, simple past. So, um, okay, so can you please tell me if you are able to see my screen? Can you see my screen? Yes. 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 Perfect. Yes. Okay. All right. So I'm going to actually write this over here. This could be less, less, um, 
las letras así todas como, como de primer grado, pero <laughs> uh, right now that's the best I can do with this program. Okay, just give me a moment. Simple. Simple pass is also called um, the the pass simple. You can you it's the same idea. Simple pass or pass simple. Okay, so you will you will hear it both. Simple pass or pass simple. Okay, so this is specifically about regular verbs. Okay, specifically regular verbs. So. Uh, we have the first one, we have rules here. The first rule we're going to be talking about is this one. Um, just give me a moment. Huh. Oh, wait a second. I don't know. Okay. I don't know why I'm doing this. <sighs> okay. Hold on. I don't know why I'm doing this. Let me. It should be easy. Yeah. Okay. Forget it, guys. I don't know. No sé por qué me estoy complicando la vida. <laughs> okay. There we go. Simple. <laughs> Simple past. There you go. See? It's, it's, there's always a more simple way to do things. Okay, so this is a simple past. Okay, so this is specifically the, the regular verbs. Okay. So simple past regular verbs. Now, Basically, there are four, four rules that we can be using for regular verbs, okay? The first of these rules is, um, okay. the first of these rules is when you, when you use, um, just like the general rule is we add ed okay so for example we have watch and then we put ed watched play and then ed played okay so that's the majority of the re regular verbs we just do that just add ed okay simple pretty simple right yes yeah okay Good. So now let's look at the other the other rules. The when we have a, a verb that finishes in an e, like like the word like or arrive or um, hate, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera, then what happens is that we cannot add another e. It just looks weird. So instead, after e's, we just add d. Okay. If there if we finish with it. E, we just add a D. For example, liked, arrived. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah. Pardonme si en algún momento no tiene sentido lo que estoy diciendo. Or if you have questions. Okay. All right, let's continue then. Now, the other rule with regular verbs has to do with um, when we have verbs that finish in a Y. But not just any Y, because if you notice here, we have also a Y. But it's different because with this one, with this Y, it, we have the... Um, we, we have a vowel. So notice this play, we have a, an A there. Whereas in this one, before the Y, we have a consonant. In this case, a D, and in this case, R. Okay? So when we have a 
a verb that finishes in a Y, but before the Y, there's a consonant. What's going to happen is we're going to follow this rule. First, we're going to delete the Y. Second, we're going to add I, E, D. Does that make sense? First, we eliminate yes. the Y, and then we add I, E, D. But it has to follow this rule. The rule is a consonant and then a Y. If there's no consonant and then the Y, it doesn't work. Okay. All right. Now, then we have the rule of the, um, well, I like to call. This is this is this is just like my little rule. Let's say this is the way I refer to it. So, en ningún lugar van a encontrar así esa regla tal como les les voy a mostrar. Because this is what I like. This is the way I like to teach it. So this is the rule of the one one one. Okay, that's how I teach it. I teach it one one one. And what? Why do I teach it as one one one? Because it reminds you that. Uh, okay, so it reminds you that it's one syllable, and it finishes in one vowel and one consonant. I'll repeat. It's one syllable and it finishes in one vowel and one consonant. Like think about stop. How many syllables is stop? One. One. What about Rob? How many syllables is Rob? One. One. Now, how it finishes in, in how many vowels? How many vowels does stop have? Only one. Huh? Only one. Only one, right? The O. What about Rob? How many syllables, sorry, how many vowels does it finish with? One. One. And it's the O, right? Okay, so in that case, we have, we, we complied with one syllable and one vowel. And then the last one represents the consonant. So we finish with one consonant, not, not two, but one. For example, in this case, stop, it finishes in one consonant, which is the P. And in this case, uh, the Rob finishes in one consonant, consonant which is the B. So what happens, the rule for this one is we're going to double the consonant and then add ED. So we double the consonant, like stop, we double the P, Rob, double the P, and then add ED. ED. Does that sound good? Yes. Do you have any questions about this? You don't have any questions? Okay. All right. Let's see if you understand it. Um Okay. I can I will I will send you this in the WhatsApp so you can have it. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to do this um
Okay. Um, just a second. Okay, please tell me if you are able to see my screen. Are you yes. able to see my screen? Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. So first, the first exercise says, Tim is, talk is talking about his weekend. Complete the sentence, then compare with a partner. So it says, on Friday night, I waited for a phone call, but my girlfriend didn't call. Now, this one here, didn't call. Why do we use didn't call? Because it, this is, if you notice, um, the the word in parentheses started with the not. Okay, not call. Okay, so what yeah. happens actually? Um, before hold on, I forgot I was gonna I was gonna show you this. Sorry, guys, I'm gonna stop sharing for a moment because I forgot that I was gonna show you the other part as well. Okay, so, um, A minute. Just a minute, guys. Okay. All right. Please tell me if um, you are able to see this. You see this? Yes. Okay, so the negative is very, actually very, very easy. Don't, don't, don't think it's confusing. It's actually easier than the rules that I just taught you. Why? Because with the negative, all you have to do, the only thing you have to do is you have to add didn't. Okay, so independent of the subject, we add didn't, he didn't, we didn't, they didn't, he, um, she didn't, I didn't, you didn't, it's always going to be didn't. And the, the, the verb, the next verb is going to be in the original form. So no change. So we're not going to say he didn't paint. No, we're just going to say he didn't paint. We're not going to say he didn't wake up. Or he didn't waking up. No, just going to say he didn't wake up. Okay. So it's basically going to be, the structure is going to look like this. We're going to have um, a hey, subject. Sir. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, when I use didn't not change the verbs exactly yeah that's exactly right Erika okay so it's going to look like this we're going to use the subject plus did not or didn't right if it's contracted and then the the verb in the base form Okay. okay. And if it's necessary, we're going to have a con. Oops, sorry. And if it's necessary, we're going to have a complement. Okay. That's what the structure is going to look like. Does that make sense for you guys? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yeah. 
Okay, so that's that's the structure here that we're going to be using. So it's actually so it's actually very very simple. Okay, and like I said, it's even easier than the than the regular verbs with in the affirmative form because this one is always going to stay the same. It's always going to be did not or didn't, independent of the subject. I didn't. You didn't, he didn't, it didn't. It's always going to be didn't and always the verb in the base form. Simple as that. All right. So I'll also send you that to the WhatsApp. Okay. So you have it there. And um, so going back to our original exercise so you are going to this you're going to put the verb in the verb in parentheses in the correct form so in this case the correct form of wait in the simple past is waited the correct form of not call in the simple past is didn't call so you're going to put the uh, you're going to put the verb in parentheses in the correct form and then here we're going to complete the sentences with your own information for example yesterday i watched or i didn't watch television so it's going to be different for every person because some people watch television some people didn't watch television so it's going to depend on you does that make sense yes yeah Okay, so I'm going to also be sending you um, these exercises for you to work with a partner and do together. Okay, um, please also tell me if you are able to see the, the exercises on, in the group. You see the exercises in the group? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, good. All right. So, um, okay, so I'm going to put you guys into breakout rooms. Mm, I'll give you about mm, six minutes and I'll create groups of about three people each. Three, four people each. Brian, are you going to be participating? Yes, coach. Wonderful. Okay. So here we go. Todo será, todo una pregunta, y todo será respondido en negativo. Okay. Can you ask me that question in English? <clears throat> Very indeed, will, will be negative. Not necessarily. Some of them will be in negative, others will not. Um, so it depends. It depends if it's in parentheses negative or not. Okay. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. okay, so don't worry about that. Um, okay. it will it will be it will show you if it says not then put it in negative if it doesn't then don't put it in negative okay, okay. all right yes. so all right so i'm opening the what? groups right now Okay, guys, so you're going to have to work together. Any questions? No, 
both for yeah. me. Okay, so go ahead. You can start working together. Uh, we have the first and the second one already. So okay. we just have to complete. Uh, no, uh, it's, it's just in the exercise. But we need to continue. So the sec the the third is I just stay home. So uh, oh, that's good, Kevin. Hello. What's good? Could you do the I just stayed home? Como podríamos ahí? Stay or stand? Pardon no, me, stay. stay no es no es irregular, va? No. No. It's regular. Uh, así no se ve nada ahí que ¿Y hoy? sí yes así. stay yes entonces ahora the next one watch <laughs> Watch it. So, watch. Watch. And I visit. 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 We talk. And uh, listen. Listen. To the mark. Ay, no. No, I know. just walked. Walked. Creo que lleva ponerse en el pero se le agrega ID. ID, sí. I walked to the mall and chopped. Lo que vimos ahí, chopped. Ahí creo que le agrega la... Doble P, pero que se le agrega. EP, chopped. Chopping. Dije. Chopped. Creo que lleva pronunciación T al final, chopped. Chop, chop. Chopped. Chop. And I chopped. Chop. Uh -huh. uh -huh. So, so, entonces, the, ya todos, ya diría así, ¿verdad? On Friday night, I waited, I wait, uh -huh, waited for phone call, but my girlfriend didn't call. I just stayed home and watched television. On Saturday, I visited Oh, I buy visited mm -hmm. my friend Frank. Uh -huh. We and talk. We talked and listened to music listen. in the evening. He invited he some invited friends. Some friends over. Uh -huh. And we but cooked a great meal. A great meal. Uh -huh. I, I didn't, didn't work, work. Very very hard hard. on Sunday. On Saturday. Uh, I didn't study at all. I just walked to the mall and chopped. Así. Yes. Me? No, no. Go a serio. No. I creo que en la pronunciación. A ver, está bueno. Solo dos negativas eran. Aquí sí. Bueno, no. 
Mm -hmm. Didn't work and did it start, didn't study. Mm -hmm. Didn't didn't call, didn't didn't work and didn't study. Mm -hmm. Only three. Um, I stay state. Last night, uh, last night, I stay at home. <laughs> Ah, yes, yes. What is the meaning in at all? When we use at all, por ejemplo, I didn't study at all. Es como no estudié del todo, algo así. Mm -hmm. Para nada. Ah, para nada. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. No lo entendía. Siempre dejo complemento. Me, me están No, but it's okay. good. That's a good question. Ok. And then, let it be in then. Sería... Yesterday, uh, I watched or didn't watch television. For example, the second, I think, is last night I stayed, stayed, stayed home. Stayed last night, home. didn't stay home. I didn't stay home, yes. Watching. For Watching. the... Few sentences and this example. Is, mm, yes. So in the in the old sentences didn't and 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 the in negative and and present. Okay. Todo lo como en esta información personal ahí puede ser. En pasado, no en negativo o en pasado. Mm, ok. Por ejemplo, last night I stayed home. O last weekend I didn't exercise every day. Last weekend I. I didn't exercise every day. O, last month I chopped for clothes. Last month I chopped for clothes. Oh, last, last year, year I visited a different company. Last year I visited. Mm -hmm. So I didn't visit any country because we don't have money. Okay. All right, class. So let's check the answers. Um, everybody's finished? More or less? Yes. Okay, good. All right, just give me a moment. Okay, so tell me if you can see my screen. Yes, yes. Yeah. Okay. So we have, on Friday night, I waited for a phone call, but my girlfriend didn't call. I just... Stay it. Stay it. Good. Stay it. Remember that... Um, it's a uh, you, yeah. So uh, remember that you you pronounce the S and the consonants together. Um, you don't put the S at the beginning. You just put 
So it's stayed, stayed. not a state. Stayed. Stayed. Stay. Stay. Yeah. Stay. Stay home. What? Okay. Does that make sense? Stay. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Next. And I stayed home and what? What? Watching. Watched. Watch. 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 Yes, and watch TV. Watch. Yes. Yeah. Okay, watched. TV or television. On Saturday, I visited. Good. Visited. I visited my friend Frank. We we talked. Oh. We talked. Good. We talked and listen. Listen. Yeah. Listen. Listen. Not yeah, just listened. Listen to, to music. Listen. Do not pronounce the T. Please do not pronounce the T. The T is should be silent. So we do not say listened. It's listened. listened. Okay. Mm -hmm. listened. Uh, we and listen to music in the evening. He invited, invited, yeah. invited. He invited some friends over, and we cooked. 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 We cooked. We cooked. took the great meal. I didn't, didn't work. work. I didn't work. I didn't work very hard on Sunday. Sorry. I didn't work very hard on Sunday. I I didn't study at all. I didn't study at all. I didn't study at all. I just walked. 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 I just walked to the mall and shopped. Shop. Shop. Okay, so shop. Be, remember, this one is um, this one double is P. the double P exactly because shop has that that um three. The, the one one one. Yeah, two. exactly the one 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 vowel. So one one syllable, one vowel, one consonant. Okay. Any questions about this? No. No questions? No. Okay. No. All right, perfect. All right, let's continue then. Complete the sentence uh, with your own information. So it's going to be different for everybody, okay? So we're going to have, last night I... I didn't watch television. I didn't watch television or I watched television depends right it's going to be different for everybody number two last night i stayed at home i stayed at i stayed home or you can also say i didn't stay at home okay so it's it's going to depend on what you what what was true for you last week i I exercise. Good. Exercise. I exercise. Hold on. Exercised. Or I didn't exercise. Didn't exercise. Okay. I didn't exercise every day. Number four, last month. I didn't shop. I shopped. Or last month, I didn't shop. Didn't shop. Mm -hmm. I didn't shop for clothes. And last one, last year, I 
visited 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 a different country or i didn't visit didn't visit didn't visit, didn't visit. Okay, I didn't visit a different country. Okay, there you go. So those are the answers. Any questions? No? Okay. All right. Okay, so that's it about uh, regular verbs. Um, I'm going to stop sharing. Okay. Now, those are regular verbs. But with irregular verbs, it's going to be different okay so with regular verbs we can we can talk about rules but the problem is with irregular verbs there are no rules that we can follow it's impossible to follow the rules okay um so what we have to do is simply we have to find out what is the the past form so i can't really give you a rule, a specific rule, because it doesn't exist. But there are lists that does exist. Um, so uh, to be able to, to learn about irregular verbs, I want you to look at this, um, let's say, a, um, like a story that we have here. Not a story, but but let's say the, uh, a follow-up of events, okay? So please tell me if you can see my screen. Yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay, good. All right, so for this one, okay, we say, so this, look at this picture and read with me. I did my homework. I did, I did my homework. Everybody. I did my homework. Mm -hmm. I did my homework. I yes. didn't do laundry. Okay, good. I did my homework. So, did is the past of what verb? Do. Do, exactly. There you go. So, the past of do would be did. Okay. Then the other one okay. says, I didn't do laundry. Okay. So here is the the negative the negative um form of the the verb do. Notice mm -hmm. that it's the same rule, the same rule I taught you before. You always put do did not or didn't, and then the verb in the base form, in this case, do. So I did my homework but I didn't do laundry, okay? okay? Over here, I got up at noon. Everybody repeat. I got, I got up, up at noon. I got up noon. I got up at noon. I got, got up at noon. noon. Mm -hmm. I didn't get up at 10. I didn't I get, up, get up, up at 10. I didn't get up at 10. Okay, good. So, got up. Got up. Got up. What, what got is up. the origin of, of got up? Get up. Get exactly, up. get up. Got up. Okay, so the pass, the, the pass of get up is got up. Okay. Get up. Get up, got up. Uh, and the pass, the, the pass in the negative of get up is didn't get up. Didn't get up. Up. Yeah. Okay. Any questions about that? No. Good. No questions? Okay. All right. Good. 
Let's continue. He went to the museum. He did, so he everybody went, repeat. repeat. He went to the museum. He went to the museum. He went to the museum. 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 Good. He went to the museum. Good. He didn't go to the library. He didn't, he didn't go, go to the library. 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 Mm -hmm. library. Yeah, it's very good. So went got is comes from what verb? Go. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So the past of go is went. And the past the negative is didn't go. Didn't go. Okay. Didn't go. Next. We met our classmates. Repeat. We met our classmates. We met our classmates. We met our classmates. Mm -hmm. We didn't meet our teacher. We didn't, we didn't meet, meet, meet our teacher. teacher. Everybody, we didn't meet our teacher. We didn't, we didn't meet our teacher. Mm -hmm. So, met is the passive word verb. Meet. 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 Exactly. Meet. meet. So the past of meet is met, and the past in the negative is didn't meet. Okay, next. You came home late. You came, you came home, home late. late. You came home late. Mm -hmm. You came home late. You came home late. You didn't come home early. You, you didn't, didn't come home early. early. You didn't come home early. You didn't, you didn't come, home, come early. home early. Good. And what is the past of? Oh, sorry. What this is the past of what verb? Came is the past of. Okay. Come. 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 Good. So the come. This, the past of come is came, and the past negative is didn't come. Okay. And finally, we have they had a picnic. 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 And the other way is they didn't have a party. They didn't they have, didn't have a, party. a party. And they had good. And had it comes from what verb? Have. 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 Good. So the passive have is had, and the past negative is didn't have. Okay, so how's that? Do we understand this? Is this okay? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Yeah? Okay, all right. Okay, so um, just to clarify, make sure that you understand what we're talking about. We have here. Let's complete this chart. Okay. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm I'm going to share with you a list. I'll share it in the WhatsApp group. I'm gonna share the um the list so that you are able to tell me what is the past. Of, oh my each, uh, of each verb. Okay, so just give me one moment. Okay. All right, do you see the list? You see the list? Yes, no, maybe. Do you see the list? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yeah? Yes, okay. coach. All right, perfect. Um, okay, so what we'll do then is we're going to practice this together. So um, okay, I'm going to share again this uh, table. And you're going to tell me 
you're going with the list in hand, you're going to be able to tell me what is the past. Okay. All right. So what's the past? So what's the present of bought? It's buy. Buy. Good. What's the present of eight? Eight. 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 Good. Eat. What's the present of felt? Feel. 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 Very good. Feel. What's the past? Uh, sorry. What's the present of red? Really? Okay, so be careful with this one because the the spelling is the same, but the pronunciation is different. So this is red, like the color. Okay, so the past is red, like the color, and the present is read. Yeah. Okay. Next. What's the present of road? Right. 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 Excellent. What's the present of saw? C. 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 Very good. What's the present of sit? It is. Sorry, of sat? Sit. What well, could? Yeah. What's the present of took? Take. 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 Good. What's the present of war? War. 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 Good. All right. Bravo. Okay. So now listen and repeat after me. Buy. Buy. Bought. 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 Eat. 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 Feel. 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 Felt. 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 Read. 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 Red. 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 Ride. 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 Road. 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 See. 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 Saw. 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 Sit. 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 Sat. 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 Take. Where? Where? War. 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 Okay, bravo. Excellent. Do you have questions about the the pronunciation? You have questions about the pronunciation? No. No. No? Okay, very good. Okay, so what we'll do then is the following. Okay, so um, last weekend, write five things you did and five things you didn't do last weekend. Example, I, things that I did, I saw a movie, I studied. Things that I didn't do, I didn't exercise, I didn't buy clothes. So I want you to think right now, what did you do last weekend and what did you not do last weekend? Five things, I want you to write them down.
So there should be 10 sentences in total. Five things that you did and five things that you didn't do. And you can always ask for questions of our vocabulary, things like that. Okay, how are you doing? Como vamos? Mm. Mm -hmm. How are you doing? Any questions? Finished. You're finished? Yes. Okay, very good. Okay, I'll give you about well, two more minutes. Okay. All right, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put you into breakout rooms. You're going to be sharing your ideas with your group. Okay. Um, okay. So here we go.
So you can share your sentences, guys. Um, for example, for example, in my case, I watch television. I went to the church. I drank coffee. I shop a pair of shoes. Or I bought a pair of shoes, and I wake up early. I wake up. I woke up. I drank orange juice. I did uh, I drank orange juice last weekend. And I didn't drink orange juice, but I ate hamburger. And I ate a different food last week. <laughs> and um, Some things that I didn't do, for example, I didn't drive at work, I didn't eat fish, I didn't give a gift, I didn't sleep early, and I didn't go to the swim. I, I didn't, I didn't eat fish, fish. And I didn't, I didn't uh, exercise. Uh, I didn't read a newspaper. And I didn't go to the bed early. All right, any questions, guys? So you it's you're finished? A correct, it's a correct my sentence. Yes? Yes. yes. Yeah, except we, we normally say go to bed, not to the bed. To go? Go to bed. Go to bed. Not go to okay. the bed. Okay, go mm -hmm. to the bed. No, go to bed. Go not to go bed. to the bed. Uh -huh. Just go to bed. Go to bed. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I, it's a I didn't go go the beach. Go to the beach. In that case, it's to the beach. Go to so the beach. yeah. So you go say go go home, go to work, go to bed, but we don't say to the. So you don't say go to the home or go to my home. Um, or go to the work, or go to my work, or go to my bed, go to bed. Just you say, just go to bed, go to work, go to, I uh, go home. Only that. Go home. Mm -hmm. Only. Okay. Yeah. That's it. Okay. All right. Very good. All right. We're going to. I'm gonna go check the other groups. Tricarísimo. Too expensive. Other <laughs> Are you guys finished?
Are you finished? Yeah, hello, you finished? Yes. Yeah, okay. All right, I'll see you in the main room. Okay, very good, guys. So it seems like you guys um, understand this. Um, I would like to hear some uh, of the things that you did. So Maximiliano, could you tell me uh, two things that you did and two things that you didn't do? Well, um, the last week I saw a movie mm -hmm. and I went to a supermarket. I then the things that I didn't do, I didn't exercise at all, and I didn't stay out of my house. Good. Okay. Excellent. Bravo. Very good. Okay. Brian, can I hear wait, two things that you did and two things that you didn't do? Ryan? See, coach. Can you tell us two things that you did and two things that you didn't do? Um, um, I'm taking on the shower in the house. So I? I take in the shower. Okay, what, what, is, what is the, the what is the verb? Huh? What is the verb? In the house? No, in the house is not a verb. What is the verb? Chawa? No. Yeah. Well, well, you can, but in that case, okay. So I, what's the what's the passive shower? What's the passive shower, Brian? In the housing. No, the passive shower. What is the passive the shower? The shower is. Showered. Shower. Showered. Mm -hmm. Okay, so give me the sentence. I showered the. Mm -hmm. I showered. In the house. Mm -hmm. Good. Another. Um, busy in my family. Mm -hmm. Okay, and what didn't you do? Do do busy in the in in the in the my family. Okay, what didn't you do? What didn't you do? Things that you, that were you didn't do. Well, 
el pasado a todo. Uh -huh. Yes, because we're learning the past. The past. So I didn't. I didn't in busy uh, my family. Okay, good. And one more. Una más. I didn't. I didn't. Uh-huh. ¿Qué más? Exercise in the morning. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you, Ryan. Excellent. Very good. Okay, guys. Let's um now just take attendance. Um all right. So I'm going to say the name. You guys um just make sure that you tell me if you are here or not. <laughs> okay. Um all right. So Adriana Marcela, no, no, sorry. Sorry. Okay. Alicia Beatriz Garcia. Fátima Roxana Rivera. Jose Ramón Polanco. I'm here. Okay, very good. Um, Kevin Arnoldo Cerna. Here. Thank you. Um, Maximiliano Edgardo Escobar. I'm here. Good. Uh, Roberto Antonio Martínez. Roberto Antonio Martínez. Edwin Antonio Torres. I'm here. Great. Um, Edwin Antonio Espinosa. Edwin Antonio Espinosa. Eh, José Alberto Orante. Mejía. Eh, Juan Carlos Morán González. Juan Carlos Morán González. Juan Carlos Padilla. Present. Ok, very good. Um, Catherine Ivonne Palacios. Catherine Ivonne Palacios. Eh, Roberto Barvin Lemus. I'm here. Okay, very good. Um, Adriana Marcela Vázquez. Adriana Marcela Vázquez. Brian, er, en, per, sorry, Brian Henry Rivas. Brian Henry Rivas. Present coach. Oh, okay, wonderful, thank you. Okay. Um, Carlos Enrique Mendoza. Surviving teacher. Okay, very good. Dani Elias Manzano. Dani Elias Manzano. Daniel Alfredo Hernández. Daniel Alfredo Hernández. Hamilton Arnoldo Sigüenza. Hamilton Arnoldo. Héctor Manuel Ramos. Héctor Manuel Ramos. Eh, Jacqueline Vanessa Fuentes. Jacqueline Vanessa Fuentes. José Alexander Araujo. Jacqueline, sorry, José Alexander Araujo. Josué David Cardona. José David Cardona. Kelvin. Kelvin. Kelvin Iván Martínez. Kelvin Iván Martínez. Marlon Alberto Peñate. Marlon Alberto Peñate. Marlon Omar Menjibar. Marlon Omar Menjibar. Marvin Arnoldo Caballero. 
Yo, teacher. Okay, very good. Thank you. Um, Oscar Alexander Vasquez. Oscar Alexander Vasquez. Oscar Hermano Flores. Oscar Hermano Flores. Oscar Mauricio Orellana. Oscar Mauricio Orellana. Rocío Jasmine Tejada. Rocío Jasmine Tejada. Y Walter Antonio Mejía. Walter Antonio Mejía. Okay. All right, guys. So that will be all for today, guys. Um, y vamos a ver en cuánto cuándo. No le mencioné a Erika. No. Hmm. Erika, ¿cuál es su nombre completo? Erika Yamilet Orellana Mejía. Hmm. Ok, otra vez, Erika Yamilet, Yamilet Orellana Mejía. Erika Yamilet Orellana Mejía, me dijo. Sí. Ok. Ok. Eh, ¿Alguna otra persona que me, se me haya escapado? Ok. Bueno, entonces en este caso, chicos, eh, ¿nos vemos cuánto? Tomorrow. Tomorrow, yes. Okay, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, so take care okay. and um, see you tomorrow. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.